So Joe Biden is out there uh, trying to relaunch. This is Joe Biden 2.0. And, 2.0 uh, what? Uh, here he is. <laughs> this is just this is just stunning to me. Uh, here's Joe Biden. He's on 60 Minutes. Oh, we just got to play the audio, right? Uh, uh, we just get, let's do the. I'm just gonna keep it in a little... Okay. So yeah, it's over my shoulder. Um, so here's uh, Joe Biden. And um, he's he's explaining to uh, Nora O'Donnell why Donald Trump, uh, why Barack Obama has not endorsed him yet. Now, you'll recall that, like, if Rudy Giuliani was verb noun nine eleven, and when he ran for office, Joe Biden is verb noun Barack Obama. And uh, so he's running his campaign as Barack Obama's vice president. Fine. That's his prerogative. But here is his interesting story as to why he's not being endorsed by Barack Obama. The Democratic Party has had Jack Kennedy, Bill Clinton, Barack Obama. This is your third run for president. Why Joe Biden? Well, because I think, as I said, there, uh, we need somebody who on day one knows exactly what to do can command the world stage. No one wonders whether I know a great deal about these issues in foreign policy and domestic policy. They're things well, I've done. And that might be one of the criticisms, too, that you're offering essentially four more years of a Obama-like administration. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell you something. I, uh, I, uh, um, I, I love the fact that all of a sudden the Democratic Party doesn't think uh, Obama was that great a president. Um, Positive. I, I find- Note that he's not refuting the premise. I am running on four more years of Obama. Uh, I just think it's funny that people wouldn't want that. Obama was that great a president. Um, I, I find that fascinating. Some have asked, why hasn't President Obama endorsed you? You guys served together for eight years. Because I have to earn, I want to earn this on my own. Did he offer to endorse you? No, we didn't even get there. I asked him not to. He said, okay. I think it's better. I think he thinks it's better <laughs> for me. I have no doubt when I'm the nominee, he'll be out in the campaign trip. Yeah. Now, folks, remember what Joe Biden's pitch is. This is the most important election ever facing us to save the soul of America. But with that said, I also don't want to get into office and feel like I didn't earn it myself. So I just said, let me do this. This is the most this is an existential threat to America. But I also don't want to feel weird about myself when I'm president. Saving democracy would feel cheap that way. I don't want to play with a handicap. Right. I said, don't do it. Don't endorse me, sir. Don't you say those words. Don't you do it. I'll tell you what, Joel, if your retinas can keep it together through the next several months. (laughs) I'll be out there in the general. I feel like I love the way you're. You I love that, the way. You, you see if you pull up that um, officer and a gentleman where he's like, I got no other place to go. I feel like Joe was just like, don't you say it. I want to own this. <laughs> I want to feel like I earned it. I don't want people to say that I didn't. I didn't win this. That was real hope and changed the way your teeth fell out. That was great. <laughs> way to hold down the legacy. Does he? I mean, they they really couldn't come up with a better response to this. Like. Um, uh, Barack Obama wants to let the people choose. No, it was all about me and my sense of I want to do this on my own because America stands in the balance. And even though I could save America with his help, I don't want to feel bad about myself. Joe, what are you going to do to get Erdogan in line? Bleed on him? Yeah, but don't worry. I'll endorse I'm going to look general. at that. I'm going to look at that medal that I got and that trophy that I put up there for winning the president, and I'm going to know deep down I didn't get it all on my own. That sort of appeal to ego, though, might work for your undecided, you know, independent voters in America. Like, nah, dude, I didn't even want to, like, go home with her. I just, like, it happened, man. <laughs> <laughs> and that sort of energy, I feel like they would respect that. Oh, it. my God. So, like I told Hunter, I said, do you really want all these board seats? <laughs> Don't you want to do something on your own? You're 46 exactly. years old.